All right, folks, the deck is Odd Rogue. The goal of the deck is to make use of newly released Jolly Roger by playing him on curve into a hero power to generate some 1-1 pirates, win control of the board, eventually start shoving that damage upstairs with things like Puffer Fist and Vulpera Toxfin and Vulpera Toxblade, eventually looking for a Seraphine Fleet Runner in case we want to have a little bit of fun in the end game. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash ruffle. Can you play Cindergrosa in a three blood deck? Uh, no. She is one frost, one blood. Seems like a pretty decent hand to just keep, right? Watch this. Hey, thank you, Dan. Appreciate the super chat. Yeah, you better watch this. Or else. None will survive. Oh, dear God. It's like pillager. Here, hero power. Awful is playing Pirate Rogue. Cue that you have become the thing you swore to destroy. I think you uh, are a little late. Someone already made that comment, so. Oh, here we go again. Wait, is it Pirate Rogue? He said spam super chat with watch this. Noobs. I, I mean, that's not exactly what I said, but uh, thank you. I appreciate it, Ray. Ruffle, you were supposed to destroy the pirate rogue, not join them. Yep. Yeah, we, 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 we got that, but thank you. Uh, thank you to Ray and Thomas for the super chats. Well, now we're just getting spammed with comments uh, about that and uh, cards that people feel should be in the deck. Mine's bigger. Another one drop would be nice, which is fortunately most of my deck. Unlucky. Never bring a sword to a fish fight. I saw in your YouTube videos that you give away free super chats. That's awesome. Is it? I don't think that's a thing that's happening. But thank you, uh, thank you, Soul Reaper, for the super chat. I 
I'm playing Pirate Rogue. I'm playing Odd Rogue. I'm playing a combination Pirate Odd Rogue. I mean, that's kind of what I'm doing. Try not to die. Uh, they shouldn't have lethal here, so I should be able to get a find a kill next turn and just lead with a sinister strike into secret passage. Smell this. No, thank you. No, thank you. I don't know where that hand's been. But thank you, Facepalm, for the super chat. No. Never bring a sword to a fight. Clearly the superior pirate deck. Oh, welcome, Lucas. Glad you're liking the content. To our strength. None Even versus odd. The ultimate. Never bring a sword to a fish fight. Showdown. You think you have enough one mana cards? Uh, yeah, I think so. This is probably a good amount. Turn is a uh, captain deckhand, so I want to save the hero or the weapon swing. The fallen will serve. Can't let back every train value, though. Hey, welcome, Caleb. This is a situation where I need to like get a um, secret passage into Zarathon. Uh, 
or we can just get three unplayable cards. Fortunately, this matchup is uh, horrendous for just about any aggro deck. Hey Ruffle, Hi. why didn't you add Thoughtseize or Inquisition of Kozilic to your deck? Are the cards too slow for the aggro plan? Also, when do we marry? Uh, I do like to discard. And never. Yeah. Thank you for the super chat, Titanic. I do be coming, though. Fun to watch games without due process. Lighter for me is a very different experience right now. So many druids. I would love to queue into druids with due process. My god. <laughs> I will gladly trade you. But nobody's playing Druid at these ranks because it is horrendously trash tier at these ranks. Because of... Alright, we keep the Serathon every time. Like, it's legitimately one of my better chances at beating an even Death Knight anyway, so... Justification. I kind of don't like these as one drops because they just die to the... I play Control Warrior? Well, I mean, <laughs> yeah. I, the, have turned our curse like, Druid is the bad deck beater, right? Like, unfortunately. Never bring a sword to a it's, I, like, Druid doesn't do well against aggro, which is most of the metagame. Which is why it's underperforming, but it does do well against slow decks, which generally aren't are also not very good in for the metagame. You are prepared for the wars. Ranks, you mean MMR as you said, right? I I mean that has to be intentional. <laughs> like you're just trying to misinterpret what I'm saying then, right? Did you ever do a deck with Archivell and Reform? I mean, I have a great many times, so yes. There's several over on YouTube. Next turn is uh, Serathon into Secret Passage, potentially. Everybody needs a casket.
<laughs> bye bye, new card. These. <laughs> oh, I'm just blocking them. Sure. <laughs> All right then. I think a defensive patches would be good. Something like an O2 with taunt. Uh, I think it's unlikely they'll print another card like quite like patches. I can be there. But it depends on what uh, like minion type he is or it is. Oh. Ho -ho! Surely this is online, right? Oh. Ho -ho! Unlucky. A little agony goes a long way. Behold, jewels of the sun. No ogre pain, no <laughs> ogre gain. Looking for you. How did I manage to hit duplicates <laughs> of the arena? I don't have that many minions in my deck, do I? I will never. Oh. This deck is so brutal to play against. It takes pride to look this good. Awful you lose this game. I mean, yeah, it probably looks like it, but not over yet. Now it is. It's not some grand revelation that you came up with at that stage in the game. Second is such a huge bummer. Forgot how bad that feels with uh, even odd decks. At least I can coin the Seraphim. None will survive. They will never catch me. Feed the fish, land lover. What is your stance on curator purator being a mech lore wise? Well, I mean, there's there's no stance. Like, there's a correct and there's an incorrect. Like assertion with regard to this. Unfortunately, they got it exactly backwards. Where curator never should have been a mech, but it was. 
but because of the play patterns that people got used to, they left it as such. But then they like overcompensated and accidentally didn't make Curator a mech when it apparently should be. But like, there's, I don't know, positioning that as um, like something that you can have a stance on when it's just accurate versus inaccurate is kind of strange. Well, Pure Raider C play in Wild. I mean, I'm going to play it, so yeah, eventually. I've already seen it C play in Wild, but I wouldn't count on it being a super powerful card at this moment. Turn 5 is also pretty slow. Hey, welcome, Buggy Man. Oh, come on! I just want to coin the Sarah thing. Does lore accuracy bother you in Hearthstone? No. It bothers some people. But I'm not one of them. I think it's probably a good target to shoot for, but there are certainly more important things. Don't you dare glide me. Anyone or to a ghoul. Anyone or to a ghoul. Yeah, that's to maybe the worse face. than a glide. Wait, this is the second time we've gotten this card. Okay. Uh, I've got a pretty good turn next turn, so I think I just hold here. Hmm. Unless I want to play the uh, Cultist or the Goody Two Shields. Anyone ought to a ghoul to the face? Who's hiding now? Welcome, Bernardo. I just die here. Is this ignite? Oh, I'm just dead anyway. Rip. That's all for now. Yeah, that uh, magnifying glaive turn was pretty rough. Valera versus Valera. Shall we dance? It takes two, after all. Good enough. 
So is Outcast Demon Hunter a top deck in Wild? I don't know about top deck, but it's pretty good. None will survive. There be no treasure six feet under. Pretty good for getting ahead early into the uh, pirate rogue. Captain turn next turn. Finally, we get to go first as well. That's a pretty big deal. Jolly Roger did some work there. <laughs> they probably could have won with the second puffer fist, which is terrifying. I demand that you put the cards that you want into the decks that you want, when you want, and play what you want. Uh, well now I have to do the exact opposite. That's incredibly stressful for me. <laughs> but thank you, Spectre, for the super chat. I don't understand why they didn't take it off the board first. I think it was maybe a robot. I don't know. It was definitely more threatening than the Follett fighter. Valera versus Khadgar! Shall we dance? And uh, on the coin again. Oh. You be playing the hunter deck you played yesterday? Uh, no. I re almost never uh, replay a deck that I've already posted a video on. Especially um, the day after. There are a lot of decks that I want to play. None will survive! a lot of cards that I want to try out. no value in uh, attacking here. If this gives me more options in the place. So one counter spell down. I 
That is a perfectly fine turn from my perspective. They don't have a chat ED this turn. They could maybe get a Flak Mage. That's uh, manageable. Wow, what's troubling you? I mean, they could also play the Chatty, I suppose. Feed the fish, well played. Never bring a sword to a fish fight. Alright. Yeah, we can just take a closer look at patches here. Rawr. Oh, is the opponent sad? <laughs> I feel like I don't know when they drew it. They must have... No, they drew the... Uh, never mind. They drew the Chatty on for. But maybe there's an argument for, like, holding back on the uh, the counter spell at zero mana in case you draw it into a Flak Mage or a Chatty. But, I don't know. Just something to contemplate while the opponent throws their Tantrum because they lost a game of Secret Mage. Couldn't possibly have anything to do with the choices that they made, though. Is, is an octopus. No, then he would be a beast, not a demon. I believe he is a floating watcher. Is a type of demon. Is this a deck? It sure is. I mean, we've been farming pirate rogue so far. Shall we dance? Keep Roger. And we hit the Sarathane. Beautiful. Are there new cards in this deck? Nope, not a singular one. Feed the fish, Sorry. Good. 
Be bad for the opponents. That's maybe one of the best top decks I possibly could have hit. Mind if you do. These, you're I'm just following you. Let's extend this game out a little bit more. This is fun. For me. Ooh. Synergy. This doesn't look like a mistake to me. Little issue here. Just check with my bank and these super chats are showing is coming out of my account not going in. Let me know when resolved. Yeah, I mean, if only, if only somebody had been trying to tell you that for weeks now. But, unlucky I guess. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat, Sammy. Jolly Roger is a beast? True. Um, I'm sure they'll get that corrected with his tag momentarily. Alright, I'll be right back. Gonna get some water. Don't go anywhere or I'll sue you. Oh, all right. I am back. I need to eat lunch. Why are you so cruel to me, Raffle? Well, I mean, you should have really considered that before you entered the stream. Like, there were, was clear terms of service that you signed as you entered that said that you would never leave the stream. Lucas went to the bathroom, sue them, please. Will do. Uh, the carrier pigeons are already delivering the paperwork. Thank you, Holly, for snitching. That's 
exactly the kind of behavior I want to uh, encourage here. Here's the thing. Uh, we're probably going to lose. <laughs> but we're just going to do as much damage as we possibly can. Ah! Never bring a sword to a fish as early as we can. These rules can't stop me because I can't read. Yeah, that's actually the perfect defense, right? You know what rats get? Uh, promotions? Thank you, Benno, and uh, thank you very much, Shadow One, for the very generous super chat. You are not the boss of me. Yeah, oh, GG, I guess. This sure is a deck that exists now, isn't it? That's all for now. You're welcome, Chris. Hey, please go to get a sandwich now. No, no. Gotta figure out a way to, like, get it without getting up, without leaving the stream. Just work on your telekinesis. It's not that hard. Or at least your telepathy so that you can get somebody else to make it for you and bring it. All right, well, somebody's been asking about how it does against Steven Shaman. I guess we get to find out. Why did you draw patches? I don't know. In hindsight, that was kind of a poor choice, wasn't it? I'll have to keep that in mind for future games. I think your gluten-free lifestyle is going too far. I don't think bread that your viewers eat can hurt you. <sighs> I don't think you can possibly have any way to know that. But thank you, Kali, for the super chat. <laughs> Sandwich Gang Riot and Rottle is paying. I'll take a spicy chicken and a large coke. Where are you taking it? Uh, but thank you, buddy. And thank you, Lucas, for the uh, the the super chat. Yeah, I'm paying for um, I'm paying for your sandwiches, just like I'm paying for your super chats. Same thing. Never bring a sword to a fish fight. Curious why you did not put the seven mana Sky Captain Crag in this deck? Do you think it's a good pirate card? Uh, no. But, which is why I'm not putting it in here. It's not in the deck.
So he finally admits it. No, you don't understand what an analogy is. I think is the problem there. This is fine. Oh, if only I... just got here I don't get to eat anymore look you can't but you should have had something to eat before you arrived at the stream you're all being very unreasonable right now I hope you realize that The most important thing you can do for sandwiches at this time is share the positive experiences you've had with sandwiches. I'll go first. My brother-in-law is a meatball sub and he works for MSF. Well, now you're just going to make chat hungry. They're going to try and eat your brother-in-law. New keyword in Hearthstone, hungry? I mean, well, we've already got gluttonous ooze and like, uh, like the, the abomination. Sludge Belcher. There are plenty of hungry boys in Hearthstone. Mutanus. It probably would clean things up if we just gave it them all a keyword, though. Valera versus Edwin! Shall we dance? There's just something so nice about an even shaman losing? True. Could not agree more. Hungry Dragon? Yeah. Hungry Etten? You can't make up cards. We've been over this. None will survive. Can't forget crabs? You never want to forget never about crabs. <laughs> that is devastating consequences. I'm just going to set up for the coin puffer fist next turn. Give me that. Still worth. Hello. I want to go wide for the uh, captain next turn. Blood and blood. 
See a puffer fist on their side? Cool. cool. I think this is like a three or four hundred percent win rate against uh, Pirate Rug. Seems pretty good. I wonder at what point we'll stop hearing the same uh, mistake jokes in chat. I guess it's only day two, so we can be patient. Hey, welcome, Magachi. Isn't the deck you are playing Pirate Rogue? I mean, it's a rogue deck with pirates. But it's not the archetype of pirate rogue. In death. Unfortunately, this is a pretty brutal matchup for me. We have turned our curse into our strength. None will survive. Give myself a chance to top deck uh, a buccaneer here. The only way we don't get like aggressively farmed by the hero power. The problem is we still get farmed by the hero power if they have like a leg strike or a. Could be worse. Never bring a sword to a fish fight. Hope Smite is going to be reverted after rotation. I don't think that's a thing that we need to have happen, though. Pirate Rogue is doing just fine and also just got some new cards. My compliments. Make it be doing even better. Right, surely that's my out, right? Cloak didn't get reverted, I don't know why. At least it's good against Quest Mage. What, Cloak of Shadows? No, that's yet another card we don't want to get reverted. We do not need to make Villager Rogue stronger either. Put this apple on your head. Ow. There we go. This will solve all of our problems. Hopefully this is not bad if we don't die here. <laughs> but we're probably going to die here. Put this apple on your head. In my name. 
That's all for now. I should probably learn to draw cards better. Seems like a skill issue there. Probably also learn to draw better matchups. We'll see how you fare, scholar. I think she just called him a nerd. You think even Death Knight is as bad as even Shaman? Uh depends on what deck you're playing. <laughs> like if you're playing a control deck, you would much rather queue into a um even Death Knight than an even Shaman. If you're playing an aggro deck, the opposite is probably true. Because the whole reason that even Death Knight exists is to decimate aggro. Unfortunately, he was added too late, thus making him an abysmal enforcer. Ha ha! Bro. Never bring a sword to a fish fight! Just fine. It seems like a weird time to play that. Ruffle, why don't you ever interact with the board? That's exactly what I'm doing right now, is interacting with the opponent's board. Super chats have been credited to my account. Thanks again for all the donations. They sure haven't, but uh, thank you, Samuel, for the super chat. aggressive decks that aren't even Death Knight. What's up, Ruffle? What decks do you play off stream the most? Uh, I don't play decks for much Hearthstone off stream. So, 
Done. Play like uh, 25 or so hours of Hearthstone on stream and then edit those 25 hours of Hearthstone off stream or on stream and then do the editing off stream. I don't need more Hearthstone in my life. Here, Alpha, I know you hate deck suggestions. Uh, yeah. It's not what, but it's more just that, like, it's. I can't do much with deck suggestions. Valera versus Rexa! Shall we dance? None will survive. We just go Roger into hero power and then have the uh Pop her face for clean up. How long does editing usually take? I mean, depends on the video. Depends on how long the footage is usually. So it varies pretty heavily from day to day. Sorry, cute cat. No. no, I'm gonna take cute cat to the face. What do you use to edit your video? I use uh, DaVinci Resolve. Uh, yeah, I also spend a lot of time <laughs> planning and preparing decks. So there's just like I do not need more Hearthstone in my life as the result of it. Which like I like Hearthstone. And I enjoy playing the game, but there be no treasure six feet and like, it is also my job. And so when I'm not doing my job, there are things that are, are more relaxing for me to do with my free time. Takes long about editing. Actually, curious. Not trying to be mean. Don't you just mark the games are good during a stream and then cut the vods to include them? Yeah, but I also cut with it. Like, at a minimum, it takes as long as whatever the video result is, right? I make cuts within the video as well. How complicated. That's the part that takes long. But you do them small, right? Thumbnail still definite. Oh, sorry about that. I thought I changed that. Dead. Might as well have some fun. These. <laughs> oh, I'm just Gold. Like, there's a reason you don't see all of the time spent that my, or the, all the time that my opponents spend roping against me, you know. So, like, there's not necessarily a very fast way to, uh, to cut that out. Or to. Like, other than just going through, playing the video back and isolating those. Think that Raffle guy is the right idea? Just throw it all on YouTube and leave it be? So, like, for a while when the, um, 
when Shut the VOD channel was like doing really well and getting uh, more views than normal, like people would enter the enter that channel and either not be familiar with the the main channel or not realize they're on the secondary channel and like call me lazy for not editing the videos or I remember when Ravel used to make thumbnails and edit the videos and it's like. It still happens. Oof, that's a patches draw. That seems like a mistake. None will survive. We have turned our curse into our strength. God, that's devastating. That patch just draws uh, kind of making me struggle here. Feels like it's okay. The problem is the captain gets stranded here. Unlucky. 
Do you watch any good TV shows? Uh, no, I try and isolate just the bad ones. And watch those instead. Almost got there. That puffer fist was well timed, but uh, they got a little bit too much value off of the uh, the strong totems. Valera Ugh. versus Nemzi. This is such a brutal, um, fun matchup. Shall we dance? Or nearly any any deck in the format right now. There we go, Flit Fighter into Tour Guide Buck on two. Ray, we aren't done on turn four. Never bring a sword to a fish fight. Not a good start for me. Hi, Ruffle. Hi. I ordered a ham and cheese two years ago. Still waiting. Thank you for the great content. I'm not entirely sure what that has to do with me, but... Uh, glad you're enjoying the content. Uh, thank you, Meatball Sub. For the uh, fi uh the super chat. You here for the tour? <laughs> Deck is strong versus disco, even definitely. Uh, I don't know. Maybe secret mage. Um, druid if it can gain armor quickly enough. You are not the boss of me. Um. Not a lot, to be honest. That's the struggle right now. Feed the fish, lover. I'm gonna have to trade these off. I don't want to, because it's like not great for my game plan, but I can't let them draw more cards off of Like, that would have potentially allowed for like a tempo. Uh... Like a tempo cataclysm. Which I would rather avoid. I mean, I don't have that many cards in hand. Isn't that just lethal? Five attack weapon. Just tapped into dead. Guess it wouldn't have mattered in the end. Just as Lincoln Park predicted. I suggest you top deck Secret Passage? Yeah, no need. That game was uh, going to end in one direction or the other uh, very shortly. Does Warlock run a lot of AoE in this meta? Uh, no, just Cataclysm. That Generally wins the game once it's played. 